Hello, it's Sweetie here, and here we are with a new Let's Play. This is, let's say, part three of my unicorn, unicorn dreams. Let's play. We have Chelsea here. She's gonna feed her goldfish, and then we are going to take care. Oh, we can't take care of it. There's nothing to take care of. Love that. Uh, then I would say that we are going to start, uh, or continue, not start, continue writing our book. I think that's a great idea. And um, Chelsea took care of some needs. Uh, I think write a book, then maybe use the toilet, and then we could go and scout. A scout? search the area for collectibles or something like that and then uh, hopefully our unicorn will appear tonight and uh, I hope he does because that would be nice but I have no clue I do have to uh, say this uh, right now uh, it is raining and there might be some uh, wind flares so if you hear any background noise I'm sorry I can't control it Apparently, the weather gods like to uh, give us lots of storms in a row. So that's fantastic. She just finished a couple of chapters. She isn't really having fun, I would say that. Then we will start this and I will... Um, we can go and try to find something here don't know if we've been here I know usually there is a seed that spawns there and then oh, I suggest you look around this training ground because there usually is a lot what? Okay. there is always something that you can here as these butterflies always spawn here usually there is more maybe there is around the corner yes there is a snake I would not uh, catch that but uh, snakes are not gonna kill you in this game and there are some seeds right here some more right here she collected that first seed we have a lot this is not a unicorn what's your name Marnie I would have guessed it was him or her, I don't know. It's training for a race, that's all we can say. She didn't catch that pet to fly, let's hope she does catch this one. <laughs> also not great. Uh, we are mostly just here to pass some time. It would be neat if she would be able to catch something. This horse is really going for it. But yeah, I can't really help it. And, uh, it's also some way that she is making a little bit extra cash so she can afford. Uh, did we pay the bills? No, I don't remember. Uh, we shall see. Did we pay the bills? I don't think so. <laughs> don't recall that she did. No, let's go and pay the bills. I think that 
the snake that she just got will pay for all those bills so that is nice if you ask me she still isn't having fun so that's fantastic uh, let's get her to read a bit of this book does she know anybody in this town? not particularly yeah, if we really need to chat to somebody, we can. Because her social is also not great. But yeah, I know for sure that if this unicorn spawns, we will chat to that. I think that is okay, but by then it's also quite late. And the NPCs in this game go to bed quite early. Unless they, they have to be out, and then they might stay out a bit longer, but... She also almost finished this book, which is neat. Uh, you can continue reading this. No, you love reading books. I don't understand these couches and these chairs in The Sims. Why are they so low? No back support. None. These chairs have way more back support. I think it also is useful that she's uh, reading tons of books, or at least trying to read some books. Because uh, I would say that that helps with making her look like a believable writer. Nothing to collect here. Wait. There is a butterfly here. Oh, in. Is this a wild horse? It is. Quickly, let's quickly look at it. Cause that's what you do when you spot a wild horse. Not that bad looking. Nice markings. Bit thin here in the waist area, but uh, I think that's gonna be okay. Oh, there's a bird right there. We could all collect this. I mainly was going to look for collectibles on the side of that hill. Uh, doesn't this lead to a water place? It does. Uh, it's a bit odd that it walked right there, but okay. Does that mean that the wild horses are gathering here? Because if they do, which I can't confirm or deny, uh, we know where to look for the unicorn. But I can't say that it's there yet. Or that that wild horse is there. See her fun is going up, which is what we want. We could chat to somebody. Let's go and chat to her. To Gracie. I think that would be nice. That's enough social. That will do. We are gonna get her to write this book and then hopefully that uh, by nine this unicorn appears. And if it doesn't, I can't help it. As I said, it's not in my control that I can uh, make this unicorn appear or disappear. And this is definitely not the content I would think it's exciting to watch. But yeah, this is how it is. It's not always action. Uh, sometimes you just need to do stuff to uh, just uh, be make yourself be able to survive. Something like that. I think I would like her to eat something before we head out. And she also finished a couple of more chapters and got some money for that.
Let's get her to eat something. Some oh yeah, and of course this thing breaks then. Well then at least we know what we do tonight if this unicorn doesn't show. This weather outside is really nice. I kind of want to scout the area to see if the uh, sparkle unicorn rain situation is happening, but I also I'm not sure. Here we go. Fingers crossed it somewhere. not there it's also not here I would say it's nowhere I don't think we have a unicorn sighting tonight it's sad yep. it's really sad well then I think this eating her dinner right now was kind of useless why isn't it there? We need it. Epic needs to show up. But, um, doesn't look like it. No unicorn in sight, sadly. I hope she uh, is able to fix this. Does she have some handiness skills? She does, so I think that's gonna be useful. Now I'm kind of glad we chatted to this crazy girl because I think that little bit of extra social helped. Especially now that this unicorn is nowhere to be seen. It's fantastic. It's just what you need in life. See, I would say that I will have this uh, Let's Play done in by 15 parts. <laughs> but if this unicorn doesn't show up the rest of this week, it's going to be a lot. Oh, that's right. But uh, you have to have some hope in life in general. That's what I always say. I do wonder, does she enjoy reading books? Does is she start did she start writing books? Uh, because she enjoys reading. What do you think? Leave a comment with your answer. Would be nice. I would love one more notification that she is getting paid for her book. There we go. And then I would love also for her to use this. And then we could let her roam for a bit. We don't need to uh, control her every action.
surely this also breaks then, because that makes all the sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely. At least our handiness skill is going up. <laughs> yeah, it's not time to go to bed. You could relax and read the rest of your book. Fine with that, but it's certainly not time. to really go to bed, because uh, if this unicorn shows up the next day, uh, we will be in big trouble if she goes to bed right now. But I think we could, well, there are still people up, apparently. We could crack that social up. Would she also enjoy that? I don't know. <laughs> I wonder if she's gonna be able to chat to her to the computer. Because Crazy said it was too late to be called at this time of night. Because then we are doing the two birds, one stone method. We are getting her social up and her fun all in one go. I wonder what Crazy is keeping. I can't read Simlish. This is what you signed up for if you opened this, um, what you call it, video. Oh, I know what we can get her to do. First, we're gonna get her to brush your teeth. Uh, then, we are gonna get her to relax on the bed, and then she can watch some TV. I think it might be wise to uh, tune into the cooking channel. That way, her cooking skill will go up, which would be beneficial for us. I have a number of questions. Gonna do if she's gonna brush her teeth, but that's what I told her to do. Yeah, I'm a bit sad that this epic unicorn didn't want to be epic this night. It always is sad, but it's uh, even sadder when you were really hoping for it. As I'm trying to make a let's play out of this while we. Uh, finish off this aspiration but I need this unicorn to appear and I think it's just random and at this moment it could be as random as can be but it's not showing up for us it's not I have no clue but these neighbors across the street are like really really uh, what you call it loud noisy Oh, she's now watching the, the gardening channel. Yeah, we don't have enough uh, gardening skill to gain any gardening skill from watching it on TV, but she does have a cooking skill. Oh. Squeaky chair. 
Yeah, and uh, watching the TV on this cooking channel helps her skill go up and she might le learn a new recipe, which is also nice, if you ask me. This rain is really doing my head and it's like really loud. And there's lots of rain. I think she's enjoying this. Oh, this is nice. Did this uh, is all Sims 2. Looks pretty similar to uh, what she would. Uh, there we go. Uh, how this game looks, sort of. But then this is just a bit more fine tuned. If you compare the Sims 3 to the Sims 4, it's completely different. Mm. Yeah, it has some of the same elements, but it's, uh, the graphics are way different. I would say The Sims 4 is definitely more cartoonish, and this is a little bit more realistic, but that's just me. Uh, I do know what we're going to do right now, which is that we, right now we are going to end this part. Uh, sadly, not really a successful part, although she did gain some uh, handiness skill and she continued writing her books, her book, books, her book, uh, and uh, I think that's great, she's in bed now, asleep, so I'm gonna wrap it up right here. If you enjoyed watching this video, thumbs this video up, subscribe to my channel so you see the next part where we might do really see this unicorn. Um, my name is Fieser Van, and I hope you have a lovely day. Goodbye.